Hi, today I'm going to do a tutorial about object paint. It's just to give you some ideas about how you can use it in creative ways. I'm not going to go, again, I'm not going to go into too much about the technical aspects. Okay, so here's a simple paint plane I made, plane 002, and then here's an ant. You might have seen my ants before, so I made this ant a few years ago, and it's a red fire ant. Yep. So it's the me medium poly model. So literally object paint is what it does. It paint you can paint with objects in the scene. And you the object paint is on the ribbon and you expand it to get the settings and buttons, etc. Yeah. So We've got lots of different icons here. I'm not going to go into too much about them. There's lots of other tutorials that have a lot of technical details. So I'm just going to try and show you what you can do with it. So, paint with objects in list. This is where it can come a bit weird sometimes. Sometimes you can paint, say, on the plane, and it doesn't paint the ant, it paints the plane. So you have to be a bit careful, but it's usually get used to it. So, um, pick objects. So we're not going to pick objects. Edit objects lists, yeah? So we're going to... I'm going to add something onto this list, and I'm going to add Fire Ant 1, which is Fire Ant 1, obviously. So that's there, okay? So now that's on the list here, yeah? So it's on your edit object list, yeah? So paint with objects on list. So that's very obvious. So when I paint, it's going to paint with this in theory. And then um, we're going to paint on paint on selected objects. So when we paint, it's going to paint on the objects that are selected. So we can paint on... I'm going to select paint, paint, plane, not pain. This is a pain, but it's a plane. And I'm going to paint. So let's see if it's going to work. Yes, and it works. So now I'm painting the ants. And it's like a paintbrush. You can just go around, okay? Right click, so that gets rid of that, that, that finishes off that stroke, okay? So now you edit anything you edit, it's not going to edit that, it's just going to edit the new stroke, yeah? And it's not painting again because they didn't select the, the plane, okay? So now don't right click and you can kind of edit it a bit, yeah? So if you don't right click, you can edit it a bit, yeah? And again, something that was weirds happened because it's painting the plane. Yeah. See, so the plane is in here for some reason, and it wasn't before, was it? So remove the plane and try and keep doing it again. So let's have a look. Paint with objects in the list and paint onto selected objects. Yeah. Let's check the list again. It's only the fire ant. So let's hope it's only going to paint the fire ant again. Yeah. And, and the, yeah. So it goes around, 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 around. And so you can paint many, many ants. You can have a swarm of ants. Or whatever you want. And then we can lift the... Whoops. We can lift it and then we can show it from above. Lift the camera. So it's early today, I'm mumbling. Right. Top view. Render. And we've got a nice bird's eye view of ants. So that's a very quick way we can get you know, paint objects onto the scene. And it's good because it's a loose creative way. It's not it's not um, you know, you don't have to set up a particle system. You know, fair enough if you're doing a particle system and you need everything to move. But if this is a still image or for a print or something or a sculpture even, you can you can use the just the object paint. Um, I mean, you could. There are ways to animate it as well, um, but we won't go into that with this lesson. And just to have another, do another little thing here. So we're going to make a sphere. Okay, hello sphere. And guess what we're going to do now? We're going to. Oops, we're going to paint the ant here onto the sphere. So we're going to do it in the same way. Paint with selected objects. Check and again the, the only thing on the list is the ants. I always convert that to editable editable polys. And then 
let's try, okay? Let's see if it's going to paint. It's going to paint on the object. Paint on the object. Paint on selected objects, okay? Let's see if it's going to go. Yes, so there we go. And we're going to paint all around the sphere with ants. So it could be like attack of the ants on Mars or 